So, so I want to tell you guys something really personal. Why I chose to leave Texas permanently three years ago and move to Alaska, a fucking state that I didn't know anybody and I've, I had never been to. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to roll the dice in life. I'm just going to fucking move to Alaska. You know why? This is the personal reason. I felt like I was living in my Montelongo family's shadow, their shadow, by staying in Texas. By, you know, maybe getting married one day and starting a family in Texas. I, I don't want to do that. Not, at least not in Texas. <laughs> uh, so I was like, you know what? You know, I'm, my grandfather moved us here back in the mid-90s, 1995, I believe, specifically. And... You know what? I'm just going to reverse this shit. That's probably why I like cold weather so much also. <laughs> it's because uh, I was, you know, I was raised in Oregon for about three years from when I was three years old to six years old. So <laughs> that's probably why I like cold weather so much. And uh, I moved to Alaska because, fuck, I love the cold, man. <laughs> I love the cold. I can't stand the fucking heat, though. <laughs> it says a lot from a Mexican <laughs> that, uh, <laughs> that hates the fucking heat. But I digress. Uh, better than I <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, I um, I, I just couldn't. After my grandfather passed away in uh, seven years ago, twenty sixteen, everything changed because I had talked to him about moving to Alaska. He was like, you know what, Mijo, you want to do it? Do it. You know, move to Alaska if you want. I mean, if that's what you want to do, then do it. I mean, you don't have any kids. You're not married. And so that's what I did, you know. <laughs> and now, you know, what I do is I, I live in Alaska permanently. But, you know, <clears throat> to kind of kind of explain things, in Alaska, you have to be in the state 180 days minimum per year to get your tax exemption as a military veteran and also to collect your PFD, which is the check that they pay you for to live there. Yes, <laughs> yes, you do get paid to live in Alaska. It changes every year. Like last year, it was closer to three thousand dollars. This year, it'll probably be like maybe fifteen hundred. It just depends. It comes from the oil reserves because we got a lot of fucking oil. We got a lot of fucking oil in Alaska. We probably got more oil than Texas, <laughs> where I'm filming this right now because I'm in Austin, Texas right now. But <sighs> my cigar went out. But uh, yeah, like because I love winter, man. I fucking love winter. It's my favorite season of all. Of all time, and I'm going to Mexico, uh, uh, Randa Salisco, uh, Guadalajara, uh, next month to see my my cousins and uh, scout out for a wife. You know, because <laughs> I don't want to marry an American chick. Nah, to each their own. But uh, you know, I I stick to my own culture and my own, my own ethnicity. And if I have kids one day. Sorry. If I have kids one day, I would want them to be Mexican American, just like me. That's why I don't. I don't believe in the whole interracial marriage thing. But I mean, I know that's super politically incorrect and very, you know, un-American, for lack of a better term. But you know what? That's just how I see things. I stick to my own culture. But anyways, uh, yeah, because my uh, a lot of my family is in uh, Guadalajara, Jalisco. And uh, I'm going to go there for two weeks. And then I'm probably going to come back every once in a while. You know, I don't expect to like, you know, wife up a chick <laughs> there uh, within two weeks. But I mean, that's a starting point for me, at least. Because I'm not getting with these American chicks. Fuck that. <laughs> uh, but I digress. Uh, that's why I left Texas for Alaska. I'm not living in my grandpa's shadow of... Staying in Texas for the rest of my life, bro. Alaska is my state. I'm the first person on both sides of my family to be in Alaska. No other Montelongo or Lusano has ever been to Alaska except me. So, you know, I kind of take that as a, a little bit of a trophy. I'm not going to fucking lie. A little bit of a trophy. I'm, I'm not going to lie. I... I, 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 I milk the clout for that because <laughs> uh you know it wasn't an easy feat to move to alaska oh, it really wasn't 
lot of money was involved with it, unfortunately. And I'm not rich. I just live off my military benefits, bro. But, yeah. I digress. <sighs> Brawly was out, and uh, I just wanted to make this video to kind of like tell you guys why I despise Texas so much. It's like, <clears throat> before in this video, I treat Texas like, I guess, if it, if it was an ex-wife. Like, <sighs> oh, I hate you. <sighs> I don't want to deal with you, but at the same time, you know, it's still home. But yeah, I, even though I've never been married. <laughs> but I'm assuming if I was a divorced man, like a lot of dudes my age at 35 <laughs> would probably, you know, relate that experience in that scenario. <laughs> but uh, I digress. Brother's out. And uh, peace. Hugs and kisses. <laughs> out.